wrist and hands are the only thing that's connected to the golf club, right? The wrists are what control how the club head, how your club moves. So if you go to lead arm parallel for me with that better right wrist, just up here, it's created everything you need to create here, right? Before, you would lose all that right wrist angle and then struggle, right? It's the priority that's on that lead arm parallel position to come back to that lead arm parallel position. Just maintain this, you've created all of your structure. So now, just turn. Perfect. Okay, and even if you need to turn a bit more, but you're still keeping that angle, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. So, I'm just trying to get the feel for this right wrist. So. Look, at, look at the difference there, the, the twist on the, the yes. what your right wrist is doing there. Yeah. See how that understands how that's moving the shaft around? Yeah. Right? Now, if you're turning in the opposite direction as you do that, so go up to the top and it's doing that. If you turn in the opposite direction, you're going, yeah. your tailbone's actually moving towards the target, not away from it. So then you're going more there with that right hip. Yeah? So go lead arm parallel again for me. Slow back transition. <laughs> 